my name is Stephen Schaefer, and today we're going to talk about the Intersect tool. Now, the Intersect tool was introduced in SOLIDWORKS 2013, and it's a really cool tool. But the reason why I want to make this video is because I've gotten a lot of questions recently about whether I should use the Intersect tool or the Combine tool. Or maybe weather isn't the right word, but should I? Uh, people have been using the Combine tool. That's what they're used to. It's what their go-to uh, command is, and they haven't tried to use the Intersect tool. And so I want to just show you just one aspect of the Intersect tool that's more powerful than what the Combine is going to give you. So here I have a multi-body part, two solid bodies, and one surface body. If I go to do a combine, uh, we'll just do a subtract. I'll pick this as the com as the main body, and the bodies to subtract from, I'll pick this. Now, that's fine. That's going to give me exactly what I want. I'll have that nice through hole, uh, but I want to incorporate this surface body, and, well, I can't. Uh, there's no getting that surface body to show up. Uh, so I get my, my sphere with that nice tapered hole. Uh, nothing else I can do there. Uh, so if we were to use an intersect instead of a combine, we'll have a little more power here. I'll go ahead and select the bodies, and you'll notice that it allows me to select that surface body. And now it's given me an intersect uh, options. All the different ways that I could intersect these three bodies together are is presented here. So perhaps I want to eliminate that body and eliminate that body. Okay, so everything that's left in blue is what it's going to give me for a final solid. I'll go ahead and intersect, and we'll hide that surface. So now I have this intersected body, something that I couldn't have done with Combine, at least not the way that I had drawn it. I would have had to make the surface here into a solid, and then I could have gotten it that way. So um, not necessarily the only way to do it. There's, you are, there is way, ways to make it happen with the Combine tool. However, I think Intersect is uh, quite a powerful tool, and I hope that you try it out. I greatly suggest it. It's uh, been a lot of fun playing with it. Until next time, thanks for attending.